<laughs> Happy Festivus! It's Festivus. When George was growing no. up, his father... Nothing. It's nothing! It's a stupid holiday my father invented. It, it, it doesn't exist! Happy Festivus, Georgie. No. <laughs> I got your message. I haven't celebrated Festivus in years. What is your interest? Well, just tell me everything, huh? Many Christmases ago, I went to buy a doll for my son. <laughs> I reached for the last one they had, but so did another man. As I rained blows upon him, I realized there had to be another way. What happened to the doll? It was destroyed. But out of that, a new holiday was born. A Festivus for the rest of us! Well, that must have been some kind of doll. And at the Festivus dinner, you gather your family around and tell them all the ways they have disappointed you over the past year. And is there a tree? No, instead there's a pole. Requires no decoration. I find tinsel distracting. Frank, this new holiday of yours is scratching me right where I itch. Let's do it then. All right. Festivus is back! I'll get the pole out of the crawl space. Well, happy Festivus. What is that? Is that the pole? George, Festivus is your heritage. It's part of who you are. That's why I hate it. Look, it's a big dinner Tuesday night at Frank's house. Everyone's invited. George, you're forgetting how much Festivus has meant to us all. I brought one of the cassette tapes. Read that pole. I can't read it. I need my glasses. You don't need glasses. You're just weak. You're weak. Leave him alone! <laughs> All right, George. It's time for the Festivus Feats of Strength. Oh, God! Turn it off! No Feats of Strength! I, Come on. I'm Festivus! We had some good times. You better have a damn good reason why you gave me a fake Christmas gift. <laughs> well, sir, I... I... Gave out the fake card because, um, I don't really celebrate Christmas. I, um, I celebrate Festivus. Feminist. Festivus, sir. And, uh, I was afraid that I would be persecuted for my beliefs. They drove my family out of Bayside, sir. Are you making all this up, too? Oh, no, sir. Festivus is all too real, and I could prove it if I have to. Yeah, you probably should. Happy Festivus! George, this is a surprise. Who's the suit? Yo, oh, Dad, this is my boss, Mr. Kruger. Have you seen the pole, Kruger? Yeah, he doesn't need to see the pole. Then. He's going to see it. <laughs> Happy Festivus! Yama, yama. You have time to go home. What are you doing here? Embracing my roots. It's made from aluminum. Very high strength to weight ratio. I find your belief system fascinating. <laughs> hey, happy Festivus, everyone! <laughs> Hello again, Miss Bennis. What are you doing here? Damnedest thing. Uh, me and Charlie were calling to ask you out, and uh, we got this bagel place. I hey. told them I was just about to see you. It's a Festivus miracle! Finish, <laughs> ready! Let's begin. Welcome, newcomers. The tradition of Festivus begins with the airing of grievances. I got a lot of problems with you people. Now, you're gonna hear about it. You, Kruger, my son tells me your company stinks. Oh, God. Why? we will get yours in a minute. Kruger, you couldn't smooth a silk sheet if you had a hot date with a babe. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> and now, as Festivus rolls on, we come to the feats of strength. Not the feats of strength. <laughs> this year, the honor goes to Mr. Kramer. Uh-oh. Oh, gee, Frank, I'm sorry. I gotta go. I have to work a double shift at H&H. &H. I thought you were on strike. Yeah, well, I caved. I mean, I really had to use their bathroom. <laughs> Frank, no offense, but this holiday's a little... <laughs> out there. Hey, Kramer, you, you can't go. Who's gonna do the feats of strength? How about George? Good thinking, Cougar. Until you pin me, George, Festivus is not over. Oh, please, somebody stop this. Let's rumble! I think you can take him, 
Georgie. Hey, come on. Be sensible. Stop crying and fight your father. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I got this. 